This next segment is sponsored by the Illinois Products Farmers Market. The Illinois State Fair is on its way, which means that the Illinois Products Farmers Market is taking just a quick hiatus. That's right. Nicole Moore and Emily Lynch are both here to tell us about it, but also to share a recipe with you um, using products that we find at the products Illinois Products Farmers Market. So it's closed down for this week. Yep. It'll be, well, we're closed this week. This is our first week closed, mm -hmm. that we're closed. So um, August 1st, uh, 8th and 15th, mm -hmm. we're closed. We reopen on August 22nd. So yeah, so um, this week we're closed, but you can get all the, you can get our fresh peaches, mm -hmm. which was what we're going to do today um, at the Illinois Ag, or the Illinois Department of Ag tent mm -hmm. um, at the fairground. So right, definitely um, come out and grab some while you're there. Yeah, peaches has become my favorite fruit this summer season. So Emily, you have something you're making with us. An what is it? <laughs> okay, it's my new favorite. This is my first summer making it. It's mm -hmm. an ice box cake, okay. which means it only gets better in your ice box, your refrigerator, over time. Because okay. what we're going to use is um, a box of graham crackers. Mm -hmm. All this is is a container of Cool Whip mixed with um, instant pudding mix. Make the pudding how you usually would, like with the milk and the instant mm -hmm. pudding, and a container of Cool Whip. Then you fold it together, and then we have our freshly sliced cubed up peaches. Three, yep. almost four ingredients for this. Yep. Okay, okay. All right, how do yep. we get started? So we're going to start with putting a layer down of our Cool Whip okay. pudding yeah. mixture. And we're just going to smear it all across the bottom. Okay. Now you say this gets better when it's in the refrigerator. So does that mean put it in the refrigerator right after you make it? Um, yeah, yeah, I would. Okay. Because then um, if you make it like earlier in the day, then it'll be ready at night time. Okay. It warms up a little we bit. Can, we're right. going to layer it. How much do I put? So that's more, okay. plenty. Okay, because then we layer it. Yep. Okay. Okay. Nicole got a little ambitious there. I did, I did, I did. <laughs> so after this layer, what comes next? We're going to put down our graham crackers. Graham you, crackers. you don't need to um, crumble them up or anything. Okay, We're just going just to gonna layer them all down. Any type of graham crackers or do you get the plain ones? Ones with the, what, what do graham crackers have? Cinnamon on it these you days? You know, these are just the plain ones, but okay. you could really use this with yeah. a bunch of different things. You know, earlier on in the season, you mm -hmm. could have used blueberries with this. You could yeah. have done strawberries. Mm -hmm. You could have done anything. And then we'll put our a layer of our peaches, peaches. on there. All right, we'll okay. this over here. Yeah, and for the peaches, um, you know, you can cut them up and uh, then put a little bit of sugar on them to kind of okay. get the juices going and bring out some of that natural or yep. just keep them, keep them, um, you know, fresh and cut. Just, yeah, we put a little right. bit of sugar yeah. on it today okay. just to kind of bring out the flavors yes. and some of the juice. I always love the ag tip. There's so many different mm -hmm. things you can get there. Watermelon, the Absolutely. peaches. Absolutely. Um, what are they? The slushies? What are they? Apple cider mm -hmm. slushies. Apple cider slushies. And you guys are going to be out there throughout the entire fair? Yeah, we start on the first day of the fair, which is August mm -hmm. 8th. Or sorry, um, August uh, Nope, it's 9th. the 8th. It is the 8th, yep, right? It is the 8th. Mm -hmm. August 8th. Mm -hmm. um, actually, we're opening on that Thursday oh, before. Okay. So okay. yeah, so that'll be the first day of the fair. Um, we open, the only specialty growers will be there. Mm -hmm. Inside the tent, we have lots of things going on, but the specialty growers have the uh, vanilla ice cream and the mm -hmm. apple cider slushies mm -hmm. and the melons and um, peaches and mm -hmm. uh, corn on the cob. Oh yeah. Popcorn, that kind of thing. So um, it's all Illinois products come in. It's it's one of the it's one of the most family friendly areas yes, at the fair. Be. We have lots of kids activities. Mm -hmm. We have ag entertainment. Um, we're located right next to the high dives. You really can't miss us. Mm -hmm. Lots of things going on in the tent throughout. Um, you can go to the State Fair website and check out our schedule. Perfect. Um, but yeah, while the market's closed, definitely come to the yeah. Illinois Department of Ag tent. It's um, always a really, really good Yeah, and, and get everything that you're missing, mm -hmm. you know. from. We'll also have an Illinois store in there where you can get Illinois mm -hmm. products to, to buy and take home with you. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, lots going on. So we're, we're super excited to get that started. But yes, um, we will be closed for three weeks um, starting this week, and then we will reopen on August 22nd. So definitely put that on the calendar. Yes. Yeah, definitely. So and guys, we'll have this recipe on our website as well, and Emily will tell us what to do and how long to keep it in the fridge. And we'll have all that on newschannel20.com. We'll see you out at the fair, and then later on throughout the month at the Illinois Products Farmers Market. See you in two minutes. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.